Oh, hey guys. Fancy meeting you up here. You don't need to come and visit me this in my new home. Well, we're about to get you out if you want. If I want. And how exactly do you plan to get me out? I was just uh, told that I had three day yeah. sentencing and I'd already served three days, but then they changed so, it to five on the phone. Can you believe that? So, yeah, we're going to motion for a mistrial. Um, Judge Bailey just told us that Judge Jackson said that. It could have been a mistrial, but he wanted to hear the case anyway, so it's going ahead. Which one was Jackson? Uh, the other guy. The guy in the hat. It, you, you realize inside... Um, listen, I think I should eat this. The fact that that is implied that it was said, and inside uh, the state legislation, it says if anything should be a mistrial, that a judge has to come forward. If you look at the legislation, mm -hmm. you'll see that. it's in. I believe it's in the Constitution, actually. It's state-enforced. It it's uh, very true. But in the same light, Soze, we file for the motion with those details. It gets passed. We then file a civil lawsuit against them. Is it civil so lawsuit so by uh, uh, disobeying the law? They should be impeached. He knows yeah, he broke the Constitution. That as well. Well, it, it's okay. both. We'd go yeah. after him, but then also you need to be compensated. Um, I mean, I got a hundred thousand dollars that they took from me. Uh, listen, if they can make it one thousand, uh, one hundred thousand, one thousand seven hundred and eighty dollars, I'll do it. <laughs> uh, yeah, but uh, I owe somebody some money. Yeah, we understand if like you may want to eat it, but I feel like this is how we get change. If we right. just sort of take it on the chin, then nothing gets fixed. I mean, do we need to get a deposition of him before we do this and make sure the evidence is submitted? Because I've heard that you need to have evidence to su submitted to put the, the, the put it on the docket unless you're a police officer or, or a retard. Yeah, uh, uh, not for this. It would be a separate docket filing. Hmm, it's really, okay, interesting. Can, what do you mean separate docket filing? I looked in the legislation and it says that... Uh, it's all all done in the in the same way by civilians, lawyers, or all the people in the due process. What's what's separate with this? Uh, so the uh, the motion for a mistrial would effectively get you out of here, get you the money back. It's as if like the case didn't even happen. Right, right, which means they could retrial the case. So what I suggest, listen, I understand you want me out, and I, I uh, uh, a mistrial uh, would make it so that the the case, the ruling is a. Uh... Not well, evident, right? But if we are to subpoena the results beforehand and get clarification on the PC and what, what, what actually happened here, because I still don't understand why the fuck I was charged on any of these, um, then at least we can have a basis to stand on. Because the, the other, the prosecution didn't prove I had the gun to go into the government uh, building. I had the gun beforehand because I was defending myself for this country against the aliens, and it was a police-issued firearm from five years ago in which I was stuck after those goddamn assholes locked me in the fucking purple thing. Okay? But I can't really say that. But either way, the point is they didn't prove it. I don't understand. Do they... Do, do they not need to prove beyond reasonable doubt? Because it doesn't say that. I believe yeah. if the judge thinks I'm guilty, then I'm guilty. There's no proof needed. You're 100% you're right. In fact, yeah. Rob and I were discussing this, and then we spoke to Bailey, and he was on the exact same page. Is that the moment they came to explain why these charges uh, were applicable to you, they should have and needed to also explain why your arguments had no merit. Yeah, them right. not being able to underline why your arguments didn't have merit, let alone the fact they shut your a lot of your arguments down. Well, then they didn't know what the fuck they were ruling on to begin with. Well, that's the thing. Like I said, if there's no, uh, if you, if the due process doesn't have a, uh, you have to prove belong, beyond reasonable doubt, then they don't have to do anything. The judge is the overseer and can do whatever the fuck they want. It doesn't matter. Except for the mistrial thing, because they did write that, because they're fucking stupid. So, Robin, this is where yeah, I, I'm going to need your help on this, is yep. if we mistrial it, yes, it's as if it didn't happen, but... Can I speak with Mr. Soze for two seconds when y'all done? Yes, sir. Absolutely. Um, but then, separate from that, what you're referencing, that would do be done separately as a... Um, not a defense for you, but actually we'd be attacking uh, the judges directly yeah 
Yeah. But you, it, it wouldn't be like, it wouldn't be a part of this. Like, this would be used as evidence for the listen, other thing. Listen, listen, listen. I'm going to be honest. I could, I could sue them, but they're likely going to throw it out because the judges have the power. Do you really think that Max, if we said to him, hey, these laws are fucking stupid, maybe we could fix them, that maybe he'd be like, yeah, you know, we probably could emphasize some things here and make it a little less dumb. Yes, I think we can. Yeah, I mean, that was the original goal. I tried to do that to Bones, but he actually has the IQ of a dead cat, uh, which is likely in the negative somehow, and he just didn't comprehend what I was putting down. I was questioning uh, the logic to make the law of the state better. I wasn't implying that I had the power of the state, which they claim they do. So the way that I've been kind of breaking it, because, look, I, it's been a while since I've known Max, and quite frankly, he's fucked me over in the past based on opinions of his, what the fuck do they call it? Like the Secretary of State or whatever? What is it, the person they appoint? Uh, the Chief of Staff. Chief of Staff. I got fucked by Juno, and now it looks like I'm getting fucked by uh, Siobhan out of the blue. So, yeah, I do think that he's kind of getting puppeted a bit, but... The thing is, oh, oh, one hundred percent. He's he is pussy whipped. He is pussy whipped. He, he yeah. doesn't have a backbone to say what he thinks, uh, and was the same with Bone. Somehow they are doing what she says. She, that she she is the devil in disguise behind. I have no doubt that that is actually Satan. Classic <laughs> like cheap maneuvers, right? Yes, but no, s s Satan. He's got... actually Satan. The red hair, everything. M more than likely Satan. The devil. There is. Uh, I think some politics can be played. Uh, in order to push some legislation forward. Now, if let's say there's a possibility, let's say that politicking does not work, right? Yes. Which is entirely reasonable. The fact of the matter is, he's out of office in six six weeks, and at best he's running the police department, which means someone else comes to this place that will likely be polar opposite of him because otherwise no one's going to vote, right? As long as... It is made very public what legislation is being pushed and the consul is refusing uh, to sign off on it. They're going to get fucked. I was thinking of dressing up as a mime and running for mayor. <laughs> you know you what? Know, you, uh, you know, you know what? You know, you know how I'd speak to everybody. Yeah, I'd wave to everybody and then I'd look at uh, Max on the council. And that's how I would speak in sign language. Nice and quiet, just like a mime would. Do you think it would work? The, the second I... class citizen mime at me. I'm joking. I ain't doing that shit. Okay, I prefer to slap God. them fucking shit. Um, yeah. Yeah, the, uh, what, what's, what is with the, the bear thing? I killed the bear and I used it as a suit. It's like, uh, listen, I go out into the wilderness, wilderness yeah. a lot and just, reattached to our uh, our true natures of uh, of humans it's very nice to detach and just reset the mind and the body and uh have a better understanding of uh, why we are really here we are here to create okay we are here to make something okay people get caught in a system in a bubble they stop creating and they stop making what the humans are designed to do and what they do is turn into pieces of shit and get comfortable in their little power bubble and ruin a fucking entire country I just need to break sometimes, okay? Fair enough. Fair enough. So, uh, Haley, maybe we don't want to keep that judge waiting. You want to yeah. see the man and yeah. then we can I shut mean, after Well, we need to know. Do you want to get out or not? Um, we can discuss that in a minute. It's up. I'll see what the judge says. I want to understand yeah, his that. logic.